I definitely heard that the compression, yeah, the da 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 da, yeah. Yep. Amazing wagon, gonna get revived. It's crazy. So you have like one of the most rare wagons. I mean, you have yours is a stick S50. I know. That's crazy. That doesn't happen out of nowhere. I know. Man. I'm so lucky. All right, good, good. Wow, this one is like 170, 165. Yeah. All right, you see, it's compression. It's sealed now in this cylinder. It's five, and from the sixth hole, it's coming out. That's crazy. So it was a five and six. Because I was looking at the four. Let's you know? let's check six now. So when I when I do the six, it should be coming out from number five. Okay. That will tell you so much. Okay, well. Crank it up and let's see if it comes out of here. Ready? Yeah, ready. Yep. Coming out like crazy here. And nothing. Good. Yep. And then I'm going to start taking the air intake off. We need to pull the injectors, all that stuff, valve cover, everything, drain coolant, oil. Or not oil, just mainly coolant from the block and the radiator too. Okay guys, so took out this air intake, I'm about to take the throttle body out, disconnect the hoses and everything here. So for that, there should be like a plug. Yeah, you plug? Oh shit, you're good, you're good. Or is it on the other side? I can't remember on this. Oh, I see. That's see? Nice. I knew there was a plug. Yeah. Oh shit, this one's tight. Is it? Can you give me a bigger flathead? Like yep. a thicker one than this? Got it. Got it loose? Is that? Uh, uh, let me know if you want me to try. We definitely need to go. There we go. That's good. Oh, it's going on to that. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I guess it goes, uh, it's going from the wrong hole. <laughs> I'm gonna open it back up? No, open it. Uh, it's fine. Open it up. Yeah. There we go. Just let it leak like that. Till she's done. Christmas came early. <laughs> I like that. Oh, currently taking the intake manifold off. And uh, then we're going to proceed the valve cover. Coolant is draining. Still have to drain the block. And some other stuff. She's coming along. This crazy Vignesh guy right there is writing everything down, making everything organized. So, so far, two bags. Two bags. <laughs> so Feels far. like we're taking so much apart. Yeah. Literally. <laughs> oh, we got the intake manifold off. Right there. And one step at a time. Okay, so intake manifold off. I'm gonna take the valve cover off now. Coolant is drained, just need to drain the block right now. Very nice. Sure. Heading to the store to get more tools and parts. And this is basically almost ready to come out. I've just got to do a couple more things. I started to remove the exhaust manifold and uh, yeah, she'll be out tonight. Crazy. What is that? You're gonna get that? I'm gonna see how much it is. There's no price yeah, on it. Yeah, okay. Well, yeah, might have to use uh, some Bondo instead of marker, you know, let it sit and then you can put the marks back together. <laughs> okay, we got more tools and parts and stuff. 
I'm going to keep on going on this. Just have a few more things left to do to take this cylinder head off. I got that removed. Okay, got this thing clutch loosened up. You should order a fan clutch as well. Why? This fan clutch is, I mean, it's probably still okay, but it's original uh -huh. and it's been leaking a little bit here and there. I mean, I would, you know what I mean? Yeah. Before it grenades and stuff. Mm -hmm. Cause sometimes they do grenade and then destroy the hood and everything. So I would definitely order another one while you're doing it. We're gonna take this drain plug out from the block. Yes. Draining right there with a bucket. That's a lot of coolant in the block. That's why you gotta drain the block. Okay, so this is at top dead center. T mark aligned right there, and these uh, lobes are pointing up, so we're at top dead center. I'm gonna start removing this Venus cover right now, loosening everything here. All right, yeah, guys, we're currently pulling this Venus cover, and then I'm gonna take this these chains off and guides, and then be ready to pull the head this bad boy this guy right there chuk chavik nash is busy ordering parts <laughs> okay got this out now i'm gonna mark everything chains and all that and start pulling everything out okay it all marked that too crazy bro midnight but ready to pull the head at least that's nice ready to pull the head She's good. Yeah. She's okay. Let me take these. Yeah, you can see it was blown. Wow, this... Oh, damn. Let's look at the head gasket here shortly. It's gonna be the best part. I'm not even watching over there yet. That's oh that don't worry about that that's okay that's just part of the cooling uh, jacket yeah, that's normal it gets it gets brown color like that but man what I'm looking for is cracks mainly before you send this anywhere don't know what this is. That a crack, or that's just part of the head, like that. Everything on the aluminum so far seems fine. Okay, so while inspecting, so these are actually this right here. That's not a crack because all of them have these kind of lines everywhere. One, two, one, two. Same with that one, that, and that. So these are not cracks. Okay, looking at the, the head gasket and all this stuff here. Um, so we had issue with number five and six. And take a look, this is gone right there. Yep. It's literally gone. 
And what's weird is this, it's almost like this cylinder before, and this one, the valves were meeting each other before. So you see all the, the traces right there from the valves. This one too, something was happening here before. It's almost like maybe the something broke or chain or whatever else and the valves met or who knows what happened. This one too, actually all of these are kind of a little bit chewed up, but it's okay. But this main problem is, seems like this has, head gasket, it's been replaced before. Yeah. It's been definitely replaced. But maybe the problem is that maybe that head is a little bit warped and they put it on like that without resurfacing the head and that's what happened right there that could be it so i'm gonna take this head gasket off the head is gonna go to the machine shop gonna get all that and get new parts there she is right there Amazing machine. Vignesh is starting to clean everything here. <laughs> Cleaning this circular part, like yeah. you said. Okay, well, all the parts, everything labeled. My project for the next month. Yeah. Amazing machine. You probably never thought that you would get to it this fast, huh? <laughs> I came by, I was like, let's get this shit done. <laughs> we got this shit off. Yeah.